Snow days called at school districts all across West Michigan today. Not here in Hudsonville, though. You take one look around the parking lot here at the north entrance of the high school. It's packed, man. Business as usual. Classes are still in session. But again, the, can't, the same can't be said about every single district in the area. Different locations require different decisions to be made. It's not one of those things you wake up and think, eh, let the kids sleep in. I'm sure some kids love it, uh, maybe most, uh, but others, uh, it becomes a challenge. So the priority is just making sure our kids are safe. That's the bottom line when calling a snow day. Not just for Dr. Doug Vanderjack, the superintendent at Hudsonville Public Schools, but for all superintendents, like Mark Belang with Portage Public Schools. You know, if a bus is delayed and that student is out there for 10, 15, 20, maybe even 30 minutes waiting for a bus to come in, that's not safe. And so if, if we're going to make an error, we want to err on the side of safety with our students. Portage Public Schools were closed on Tuesday. That's their third school day in a row shut down over inclement weather. B Lang made the call in advance Monday night, which I'm told is rarely the case. If we go just on a forecast, that forecast isn't always right. So we want to get as close to it as what we can. So usually by five o'clock in the morning, we're making our call. B Lang says the district is in constant communication with the road commission and the city to assess driving conditions, plus they have their own team of people testing the streets. Vanderjack and Hudsonville Public Schools do the exact same thing, hitting the road at 4.30 in the morning. If it's hard to see the road, that's a good indicator. If we have a hard time stopping at intersections, that's a good indicator. If our parking lot simply cannot stay clear, that's a good indicator. Both Vanderjack and Belang tell me what it really comes down to is not necessarily snow totals or travel situations, it's the temperature. Anytime the wind chill hovers around 20 below zero, they'll likely call a snow day. That was the case for Portage, where it's a little chillier, but not in Hudsonville on Tuesday. It's cold. Uh, it's not quite cold enough, uh, and we want our kids in school. Uh, we uh, care about our kids, and we can educate them a lot easier if they're in person and sitting here. Yeah, so to put it plainly, there's no magic eight ball that districts have that helps them realize if and when they should call a snow day. At the end of the day, they want to keep kids in school, but only if they decide it doesn't also put their safety at risk. And based on the forecast, it looks like those tough calls are far from over. In Hudsonville, Max Goldwasser, Fox 17 News.